Hey everybody, I wanted to do today's word of the day, divinity. I apologize for the background, I'm still waiting for my posters to be printed off where I can have a studio background. We are transitioning from Facebook to YouTube after Facebook stopped allowing us to post to all 48,000 of our followers we built. So right now, I'm waiting for the posters to be printed off. This means I should have some more time, or I will have some more time for subliminals. I really want to focus on the subliminals and really push for 10 million or 20 million in diseases cured heading into next year. We just finished our first year. We went well over a million dollars in diseases cured all around the world for free with our subliminal messages. It truly is amazing and I do not look at life the same anymore. I do not look at energy. I do not look at the subconscious mind the same anymore. It, the whole world is just completely different to me after this journey and I want to keep doing these words of the day to really offer you guys some more perspective on life, some more awareness on life. And today's word of the day is divinity. And divinity to me, uh oh, <laughs> I lost you guys there. Divinity has always been something if you look at if you look at history, you know, they've all we've always had the pyramids and Egypt too, especially like not just the pyramids, but if you look into I'm living in Mexico right now, and even the Aztecs, you know, had their pyramids. You know, in Cancun they have pyramids, all over South America they even have pyramids. And it's always been this this desire to reach higher and higher this higher state of consciousness and right now I would say where we're at as a humanity we are now closer to this perfect and pure absolute unadulterated power we have had four years I believe we're coming on to five years now a hundred, excuse me, one billion, one billion people listen to the love frequencies. And that's over the course of just five years now. And if you read through the comments, you know, you can, not all, the vi not all of the videos are legitimate, but if you read through the comments through the legitimate videos, you discover the, the unadulterated power of the love and miracle frequencies that scientifically all of life, including the plants, the stars, the rainbows, the trees, all of life vibrates on. And this miracle and love frequency is exactly what cured oil spilled water in one day. And the, the scientific studies and the embracing of this vibration of miracles and love has never been more achievable now than ever before and as we grow closer as you know humanity grows closer and we go closer to this perfection right this perfection i mean i i truly believe that in our lifetimes that we are going to live forever that that's a no-brainer but i also believe we are going to reach a perfect utopia humanity. We are now closer. As technology continues to improve and as subliminal creators and subliminals continue to, to break out and to, to continue to branch out and we are able to do even more with just the subconscious mind and subliminals, we can get medical help to people all over the world with just subliminals. And as frequency and sound therapy continues to improve, I, I, tr I truly believe not only are we going to, going to live forever, but I believe crime rates are going to drop to an all-time low, and we're going to have more people discover themselves and start making their own unique 400 trillion to 1 contributions to life. And this is what divinity is. It's, it's why I preach in all of my videos that you are a 400 trillion to 1 miracle. 400 trillion to 1 miracle. This is your divinity. You were born a vibrating miracle that all of life is already vibrating on. Now it's your free will 
or it's your it's your it's your life purpose to embrace and discover this 400 trillion to one miracle again and i say again because as we were born as you were born a little baby you went through you know all of the all of the media and propaganda owned by one psychopathic family that understands everything that we understand about the subconscious mind but use it for their own gain and to control and manipulate the masses so this is this is you awakening to your divinity right this is you being born again when you truly understand aka discover yourself on the inside you're reconnecting to the 400 trillion to one miracle that you are you are connecting to the you are now connected and aligned with the vibration of miracles and love you are now complete you are not insecure you are now complete absolutely 100% complete you have everything that you will ever need your your true self and as you meditate as we meditate to these love frequencies and these miracle toads we activate more and more of our brain our conscious right we scientifically understand that olympic meditators that meditate for tens and tens of thousands of hours their brains are 100% activated in gamma all the time this, this is phenomenal this is this is us and, and, and as sound therapy and sound waves and the whole the whole sound movement and frequency movement improved because energy is all that there is right the physical world is an illusion that manifests accordingly to our subconscious mind's thoughts it's, it's how the universe is programmed. It's how the galaxies are, are programmed, right? It's who we are. It's, it's, all, it's in all of our spiritual DNA. We cannot deny it, unless if you're a fool. Now, as sound therapy continues to improve, and as, sub, as subliminals continue to become more, more accessed and understood, I, I truly believe that divinity is now easier to achieve than ever before. We can now reprogram our subconscious minds back to purity and, and closer to perfection through action. You need to take the action with the subliminals. But through time, we can now as a humanity realign with our birthright of divinity now more than ever before. We can now meditate to the the love frequencies like these Olympic meditators we just talked about and get closer to this divinity than ever before. Get closer to the one, the one conscious. And I and I have I want to end this video on an, on an idea because there's no this is just through understanding and awareness that I truly believe we were or were we're heading in. 50, 30, 20 years, I truly believe where we're heading these next couple of decades. Where we're going to have this awareness, the level of awareness as a collective humanity to have a utopia perfection. But for those that understand how the science behind life, the laws of the universe, the laws of the galaxy and all of life, that Death implies life, and black implies white. Good implies bad, and bad implies good. This is wisdom. These are, these are the, the laws of the galaxy. This is wisdom. This is why a very wise farmer will throw down and buy even more seeds during the drought. Because he understands, through wisdom, that the good is going to be coming around the corner. And when it does, the bad is when you get in on it. You don't wait until it's going good. You wait when it's crashing, and then you buy in. Little little investor advice there. So what we understand, what we have here, what I truly believe is that our thoughts create the physical neural pathways in our brain. Our thoughts create the physical world. Now, when you align with the vibration of miracles and love perfectly, and your thoughts are connected to this perfect vibration, we can create the physical world and I truly believe it was where we're going to be in 20 or 30 years is exactly where the first exactly where we were once at I don't believe there was a creator I believe there were 
billions, if not millions, or hundreds of millions of creators that were aligned with perfection, that were aligned with perfect consciousness, all knowingness. And then I believe, as I just mentioned, it was this perfection that required an absolute destruction in order for everything to start over and build towards an even greater perfection, which means that, that our perfection or our alignment with absolute absolute purity and absolute goodness is going to last forever. And I know a lot of you may have been lost. Like I said, that may be a little too radical for some of you new people that are new to subliminals or new to all of this. And I understand that. But I just wanted to throw that idea out there to some of you that really understand energy and really understand all of this, right? Because this is where we're heading. You may not understand it right now, and some people may not want to accept it right now, but in, in a year, a couple of years, people want to watch this video, and I'm, I'm going to post this video, right, the link when this starts to happen. I truly believe that's exactly the history of humanity and the, the history of life. I truly do. And we'll find out these next, right? We'll find out for sure. But that's truly what I believe through my understanding. That's the root. The, that's where our root co roots come from. And then after the absolute destruction was the rebirth. Was the rebirth. And then it's taken thousands of years. But now we're heading towards an even greater perfection. And I, I believe the only thing greater than an absolute perfection, which is where, you know, which is what led to our origin, is an eternal absolute perfection. I love all of you. This is divinity in a nutshell. Take care of yourselves. Appreciate yourself. When was the last time you told yourself, I love you?